Welcome to today's math lesson. In this lesson, we are going to review our five times table. At the end of this lesson, you will be able to count in fives, recognize multiples of five as repeated addition, and identify the multiples of five. For this lesson, you will need the word times table, count, fives, multiples, zero, and multiplication. So, for the first one, can you recall what is 5 times 1? If you've guessed that 5 times 1 equals to 5, well done! 5 times 6. Remember, here we have five, 6 groups of 5, so now we can say 5 times 6 is 30. 5 times 4. Can you guess what 5 times 4? If you've guessed that 5 times 4 is 20, well done. Now we have 5 times 7. Can you guess what is 5 times 7? Remember that 5 times 7 has 7 groups of 5. So 5 times 7 is equal to 35. 5 times 2. So here we have two groups of 5. So 5 times 2 is equal to 10. Can you guess what 5 times 10? <clears throat> if you've guessed that 5 times 10 is 50, well done. 5 times 5. Remember, here we have 5 groups and in each group there are 5 things. So 5 times 5 is equal to 25. Let's go to the next one. Here we have 5 times 11. 5 times 11 is equal to 55. If you've guessed 55, super job! 5 times 8. Can you guess what is 5 times 8? If you've guessed that 5 times 8 is equal to 40, you are a star. Now we have 5 times 3. So remember, we have 3 groups and in each group, there will be five things. So five times three is 15. Now we have five times nine. So we have nine groups and in each group, there are five objects or five things. So five times nine is equal to 45. And the last one, 5 times 12. Remember, here we have 12 groups and in each group there is 5 things. So we're going to say 5 times 12 and we can count in 5s to find the answer as well. But 5 times 12 is equal to 60. We've come to the end of today's lesson. I hope you all enjoyed it. Assalamu alaikum. See you tomorrow.